Google's Project Loon wants to get the whole world online via balloon. Sound crazy? Well, here's how they plan to make it happen. Google sees a future where Wi-Fi is provided to all through a fleet of intelligent balloons, and it's already in the works. How did the aptly named Project Loon get started? Well, with one ambitious idea, Wi-Fi for the whole world, and some inspiration from a whiteboard. I happened to walk by this whiteboard in the hallway that had a balloon drawn on it, and it said, Wi-Fi for the world. So I went over to Rich's desk and pointed at the drawing and said, so, you know that's crazy, right? And he basically said, well, prove it. The project originated in Google's XLab, an experimental division of Google that was once rumored to be designing a space elevator, but Google has since denied that. Internet balloons, though, are already being tested in places like rural New Zealand, where some residents, like this guy, have been unable to get reliable internet. We've gone through a number of different internet providers to try and get reliable internet. It was so slow that we had to click on a page and um, go and find something to do for 10 minutes. The balloons are positioned at a very, very high altitude, higher than airplanes fly even, at about 20 kilometers above the Earth. But how do they stop the balloons from, you know, acting like balloons and floating away never to be seen again? Well, being Google balloons, they're also very smart and can access publicly available weather data to ensure that they're evenly spaced out. The balloons can know to adjust their altitude to catch or avoid certain currents accordingly, and it's so high above the Earth, wind patterns are predictable enough where this could be possible. So in theory, the denizens below would never have to wait for a balloon to float on by to get Wi-Fi. If one floats onward, there's another right there to pick up the slack. Project Loon is also not without skeptics. Bill Gates, whose foundation works to improve healthcare globally, implied in an interview with Bloomberg that in many corners of the world, there are more immediate concerns than high-speed internet. However, if you happen to live in New Zealand and are interested in learning more about the pilot program, you can register your interest at google.com slash loon. What do you think? Is Project Loon awesome, far-fetched, or a little too Skynet for your taste? Let us know in the comments below or join us at our TFN Google Hangout this Thursday. See details below. For TFN, this is Annie.